the coast and creeks of the city of Mumbai are lined with an often overlooked and neglected habitat. It acts as a life jacket for the city. The mangroves and mud flats. This unassuming forest holds some unique secrets. As a part of the intertidal zone, a thriving ecosystem of diverse flora and fauna comes to life with the receding tide. As the tide lowers, many organisms emerge out in the open. One such peculiar animal is the fiddler crab. Males have one enlarged claw and one small feeding claw, whereas both claws of females are small feeding claws. The name fiddler comes from the constant motion of a male's small claw while feeding. It appears as though the crab is moving a bow across a violin. They also possess stock ties for better peripheral vision. And now, it's show time. Males wave their enlarged claw for two reasons to claim territory by signaling dominance over other males and to attract females for mating. Turf wars are a competitive affair. Favorite burrows and feeding grounds are at stake. Intruders are always lurking. There is no neighborly love here. The territory needs to be defended and the size of the claw does all the talking. The intruder is banished. From waving for dominance to now waving in desperation. The male hopes to get the female's attention by waving his large claw. The prospect of a mate excites the male. The performance seems to be working. It's a tough audience to please, but the male soldiers on, believing in the size of his claw. But the size doesn't always matter. A relatively small male mates with a larger female here and they proceed to go inside a burrow. But a larger, rather jealous male doesn't seem to approve of this union. A large claw, but an equally fragile ego. Competition for a female's attention can get pretty stiff among males. But sometimes, despite best efforts, Success doesn't always come their way. For now, the female is more interested in a different prospect. Food With two feeding claws, females feed twice as fast. Fiddlers feed on algae and organic matter in soil. They grab the surface sediment with the feeding claw and transfer it to their mouth. A complex set of mouth parts sift out the organic matter and then a small pellet of filtered soil is spit out. Since males have only one feeding claw, they spend double the amount of time feeding. That's a lot of work. And now, he needs some rest. The 
the habitat of fiddler crabs is drastically changing today and the crabs have no choice but to adapt they have learned to thrive in the cracks of our concrete jungles which have come up in places of mangroves mangroves are a neglected habitat where untreated sewage often goes unchecked the fiddlers have to filter through our trash while feeding and it seems they haven't acquired a taste for plastic yet fiddler crabs are ecologically important for their habitat the burrows that they dig aerate the soil this helps in oxygen dispersion in the mangrove soil which is oxygen deficient this burrowed mangrove land of fiddlers is also home to a number of other animals like these pug marks suggest the presence of a jackal the apex predator of this habitat the flamboyant flamingos make this place their home in the winter months raptors like the black kite patrol from the skies while the herons and egrets hunt on the mud flats this dog faced water snake savors a fish it just caught and the mud skipper skips around feeding in the mud surrounded by innumerable snails and slugs such is the diversity in the mangrove neighborhood of the fiddler crabs it is time for the fiddlers to head back into their burrows as the tide rises again